starting with the satellite operation. I've just switched that on inside, as you can see. Automatic swivels around to get the signal. If you was to start the engine and forget about that, it will automatically fold down. But I'll just demonstrate that first. Fully motorised European. satellite dish it's also got your multi-view standard TV aerial up there as well how nice is that so here we are folks the top of the range Contiki Vogue 2006 and only two owners from brand new Ticks a lot of boxes this particular vehicle, as I'm sure you will know. Fixed bed, full berth, semi low profile, built for cruising. I drove this vehicle 220 miles back yesterday. I can confirm it cruised at 70 miles an hour on the motorway, and there's still plenty left. You'll not have to worry about Scottish mountains or European tours in this bus it's got all the bits and bobs and lots of bits and bobs to discuss reversing camera ladder Fioma 2 bike rack one of the last two owners has gone to trouble doing a lot of security Fioma warning a Fioma locks to every single panel uh, it's got two leisure batteries this particular model, one in there and one underneath here, I can lift this up. I have done a picture of it now, it's a little bit tricky, absolutely spotless. Room for two gas bottles, one supplied, but as I say, room for a second. I've done a habitation check and everything works and functions as it should do. Good tyres all around, alloy wheels, upgrade front blinds, all the keys duplicated with an extra alarm, remote control, just demonstrate that now. And there, it unlocks. As well as the secondary immobiliser. Infrared sensors. Nice to uh, have the security of that, as well as a lower insurance premium when you can tell them like a recent top of the range engine battery replacement there's the 2.8 indestructible turbo diesel engine again massive facility and storage area More bits and bobs, external barbecue facility, more security, outside mains hookup, Fetford cassette toilet of course, all being sanitised, working as it should be, flush water, exhaust for the hot water. Stunning condition folks, nothing negative or detrimental to say body wise and inside is exactly the same.
see how easy that was. Low mileage by two owners. That buzzer you can hear is the outside uh, electric step that was on. 37,000 miles. Reversing camera. Start the engine. Fire it up. And there you have it. Hard to see the sunlight. Oh, there you go. Five speed manual. 212 volt power points. It's never been smoked in, as you can see there by the cigarette lighter. So both the front seats are kept in swivels. Just turn those around now. And when I say this is immaculate inside, I really mean it. In fact, the carpets have never had the covers off. It's all the plastic covers still on. So there's overmats over the overmats. I think you're getting me drift. I've gone to the trouble of fitting out and cutting to fit an overmat, as I say, over the original overmat, so it looks like they've got the original covering in from the factory. And underneath is your wood floor. Laminate for. It's the same story all the way through. Wardrobe. There's your Omni View standard TV aerial. That's your wardrobe. Table. The only thing detrimental, negative to report on the whole of the interior of this vehicle is the size of a, well, a thumbnail. You could certainly get, we certainly see if we can get that looked at. In fact, what's this? That one's taken off. It's someone's tried to put, do a little repair job, made it worse. But yeah, that's the only thing negative to report on the whole of the interior. Mains, easy access to the boiler and the hot water system. Electric step. Mains or oh. electric control panel. Showing all the stuff working. Shower. Not forgetting the kitchen sink. As you can see, all the lights are working fine. Well, they would be if they were switched on. As you can see there by the green light, the hot water and central heating system is working as it should do. See if we can get the air. Uh, absolutely spotless, doesn't look like it's been barely used. Yeah. That's a safety feature. If the top cover is not quite vertical, it switches the gas supply off, which is a very good security uh, safety feature. So if you're driving along, that'll shut off. So unless it's absolutely fully open on there, and as you can see, now we've got gas. Nice blue flames is what we want to see, folks. Doesn't look like it's been used. And similar with here, grill pan, that's good. Never seen any toast or bacon. 
Everything functioning as it should do. Storage. Fridge freezer. On three ways, you can see that it's currently on the 12 volt for while camping. But you've also got the gas facility as well as mains. Most people just put it on the auto and you can just really forget about it then. As you're driving, it'll be on 12 volts. As you're plugged in, it'll automatically go onto mains. Fan heater there, as you can see, or fan extractor rather. Lights. Microwave. Lots of cupboards. Whole place there for your cups, plates, dishes. Goes without saying it's bone dry this. That's had a habitation check. And the floor solid, no leaks. I think you're getting the uh, story now. Lots of service history on there, which I'll go through. Midge nets, blinds, to three of the TV. Lovely fixed bed. That cover doesn't look like it's ever been slept on. It's obviously had covers fitted, which is nice to see. Loads of under bed storage. It's got a couple of my chairs in it. Toilet, full size fat fish swivel. That's been sanitised. Shower. Everything functioning as it should. And there we go folks, I'll be happy to deliver this anywhere in the country, free of charge, you're under no obligation, test drive it, have it inspected, make sure you're happy, if you are, all I ask is a lift to the nearest train station, I can't be any further than that folks.